天上埋埋埋埋埋埋埋埋埋埋埋埋埋埋埋埋埋埋埋埋埋埋埋埋埋埋埋埋埋埋埋埋埋埋埋埋埋埋埋埋埋埋埋埋埋埋埋埋埋
So then when we come to the <coughs> the part of um, the, the death process, um, a person, ideally a person with highest capacity in this lifetime has realized the nature of mind, has abided, continued to abide within self-knowing, self-illuminating awareness, free of any grasping to conceptuality. So if one is such a person who has recognized the nature of mind, <coughs> and then at the time of death, first the five elements of the body dissolve one into the other, and after that all the thoughts, attachment, aversion and ignorance dissolve one into the other, and once everything is dissolved, one comes to the ground of Buddha nature. Um, there one may recognize the uh, clear light of the Dharmakaya. Any person, even a person who has not trained in one's lifetime, once the afflictive emotions have dissolved into each other, they arrive at the Buddha nature. Um, the question is whether or not they recognize this nature. So here is that may they um, may they merge the expanse with their awareness. That refers to the Dharmakaya Poa that we have mentioned yesterday. So if one is a person who has trained within one's lifetime, then one will recognize this to be one's own true nature. If one has trained within one's lifetime free from distraction, one continues to abide within the nature of mind and then it is just like sky merging with the sky and one attains enlightenment in the Dharmakaya. So it is called um, entering into the empty space of luminosity. Referring to <coughs> an individual with highest mental capacity who comes to this state of the Dharmakaya, recognizes it in the first bardo, and then attains enlightenment. Then those individuals who have not trained throughout their lifetime, even they come to this place of Buddha nature, they do not recognize it. And again, they become deluded, starting with the notion of the I. Again, misconception arises, confused appearances appear, and again they are deluded by samsara. So first again the thought of a self arises, and from that the six afflictive emotions again arise, and one moves on to wander in the part of becoming. So here um, the prayer is made, may 